I heard you needed me, so here I come. Here I come. What's up, y'all? It's me, Nikki, Tori and Goddess, coming in with a quick message. Somebody pulling on my energy. They want to know something. If you would like to donate to the channel, there is some information in the description box. Because you show sure enough pulling on me. You've had some confirmation for whoever this message is. But you don't want me to know it's you. You've you've been hidden. You've been hidden. You've been hidden. Your face has been hidden. I've had I'm not even seeking your face. I heard you supposed to be seeking most high's face though. You're supposed to be seeking some spiritual guidance. Somebody just bought a car with a V8 engine. Mm-hmm. Somebody just bought a car with a V8 engine. Nice car. Almost something like your dream car, but not for real, though. Somebody's dream car is an old school car. Old school, old school, like 67, 70-something. You know what I'm saying? My dream car is a, is a Corvette. I think it's an 82. I'm not sure. My mom's, uh, one of her close friends, her child's father, had um, two Corvettes. And of course, 76, 1976, the best year ever. 76 Cutlass, I had one too. I had one in 2006. Somebody feel like time passing them by. They feel like time passing them by. They want some answers though. They want some answers to the reason why they're here. Somebody is searching for, for some answers about why they're here and why they've, they want some answers. Why they're going through what they're going through right now. Why they've met some people that they, that they um, thought they were going to have lifelong connections with. And it's like these people were removed from them, from their lives. Um, somebody want to know um, why they keep being uh, spiritually attacked. As well, right? Um, issues with their parents. It's like a um a trickling effect too, because now you're having those issues with with um your children or those those youths that's up under you. A little bit of depression too. I just heard they say grab these first. A little bit of depression. But you be shaking yourself up out of that. I know that's right. Cause being stuck in a in 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 a depressive state, oh my goodness, it can it'll throw you off and you will lose some years, right? Weaken you and weaken everything around you structurally, right? Somebody searching for some structure in their life, trying to get on a good foot, right? Trying to get on a good foot is what I heard. You just want a message. So we're going to let them fall as they may. This message may resonate with the rest of the soul tribe. May resonate with the rest of you. Um, if it's relatable to your life circumstances, then, you know, tap into that part of the message. If not, you know, take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't obsess. I may say a man, you will say it's a woman. Blase skip this, that, and the third. And that's what somebody coming to you with on a regular basis. Blase skip this, that, and the third. Want to break free. Somebody want to break free. I see some type of issue, you know, with investments. Some type of argument about some money, right? When you were trying to be genuine, you know, trying to be genuine and something popped off, something popped off to where you had to rethink what it was that you was doing concerning your investments, right? Your time, your money, your energy. Somebody is attracted to the innocence of your nature. You know, we all have battles that we are fighting behind closed doors. You know what I'm saying? 
That's what I heard too. And it's a battle that you fighting that nobody know about. Mm-hmm. A battle you fighting, you know what I'm saying? Nobody know anything about. You keep a smile on your face, though. Keep a smile on your face. Your laugh, the loudest laugh in the room. You know, you trying to, you, you know, you trying to keep it together. The G said, decline that offer. Be modest about it, too. Be modest about it. It's like it was, it was unwelcome to begin with. It was unwelcome to begin with. Player energy. Somebody has um, shown enough, shown enough, then figured it out. Somebody figured it out. You figured it out. That, you didn't figure it out. They lie too much. They lie too much. It's like, and it's, it's, it's like, damn, are you believing your lies? Because you've, be you've believed these lies and they, they made it so believable. Like you, like they, they can't be, you know, making this up, right? And it was, it was a fable and there's a lie connected to that lie and that lie as well, right? It's about what you devoting your time to, right? Presently. What you paying attention to right now, right? And it's like the energy. The energy around you. Like you on pins and needles and you feel like you got to walk on eggshells. Trying to forget about some arguments. Trying to forget about some arguments. Trying to be modest about some, about some things, you know? Um, whoever that person is. Um, the G said decline the offer. Because they a liar. They a liar. Family. A family united. A family united. Because of some changes with some finances, right? It's like, but damn, you know, the energy. It's like it's back and forth. Back and forth. Unrequited doesn't begin to define it, is what I'm hearing. It's like going against your word. Somebody went against their word. Somebody went against their word. And your intuition already told you not to go there, right? Something about an investment, though. Something about an investment. Maybe renewing something. Renewing something. <coughs> renewing something. It was like keeping your word like an oath. An oath. An oath. Mm-hmm. The truth is being revealed, right? It's like the, the, the truth... Is being revealed. That's what I heard. The truth is being revealed. A woman of fire. This woman can have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius in her chart. Her sun sign. Her, her birth sign. Her rising sign. Her moon sign. Take it where it resonates. But it's, 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 it got something to do about. What was left out? What was left out? Somebody's child. Somebody's child. It got something to do about some... Yeah, look. Somebody not keeping their promises. A oath. A oath. A oath. To protect and honor um somebody, somebody in the family, somebody in your family was done wrong, somebody in your family did you wrong, somebody in your family did you wrong. Your child could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, 
one of your brothers or your sisters, your mom or your dad can be either one of those signs, right? Either one of those signs. Trying to outsmart you. Trying to outsmart you. Somebody trying to alert you to something because they, they want you safe. They want you safe. They're trying to alert you to something because they want you safe. Mm -hmm. They don't want you to lose out. They don't want you to lose out. Decline the offer. It'll be some loss there. It'll be some loss there. It's, it's someone that you trust in. Your kids, your son, your daughter, your kinfolk, your brother, your sister, your mom, your dad. Take it how it resonates. It's somebody that you trust in. And they, and they did something. They did something. I'm seeing this. We belong together right here. They did something against you against you they did something against you to breach your security where you would be safest at they told you to de to decline the offer not to pop up not to visit not to pop up not to visit don't send any unexpected gifts don't ask this person out on a date Something to that nature. Being petty. Being petty is something that they did. It's something that they did. It's a it's a a feminine energy. A mother, a daughter, a sister. It's something that they did to prevent you from having a a strong alliance with someone. Mm hmm It's something that they did. They told you not to trust or honor a connection. They told you not to trust or honor a connection. So whoever this dark-haired woman with this fire in her chart who gave you this sound advice, there's no loyalty there. I'm hearing cash cow, although this is a horse. I'm hearing cash cow. I'll take that where it resonates. I'm hearing cash cow. I'm hearing cash cow. Love and happiness, or who will I choose? They got options. Whoever this woman is in your life, dude, bruh, they didn't like the person that you were with. These women in your family, did Jesus say in no disrespect, um, they celebrate everywhere is what the Jesus is saying. These women who had a hand in raising you, I'm, I'm just saying what they're saying. Who had a hand in raising you. Um, they scattered their energy. Amongst their community. Um, and they're always in this Chris Bender energy. Talking about who would I choose. They always juggling. Mates and dates. Spouses even. I heard family as well. Well god darn. It's about to be a confession. Because one of these women connected to you. Your sister, your mother, your daughter. Truth and loyalty then came to the table. Because this energy here, this spirit, this spirit, you know what I'm saying? It's an opposing energy that's been surrounding some family circumstances. You know what I'm saying? Some air energy, possible air energy, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or it could be um, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They, they've got promoted in life, maybe a proposal of love, 
Um, they just got linked with somebody who they feel like they about to spend their life with, possibly. Um, they counting their blessings in that area of their life. Um, they could have changed jobs, um, started a new career path that's going to be successful. Um, yeah. And they counting their blessings in that area, right? Yo, kinfolk, put it in your mind for you to have options. And and somebody just said that you 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 X out someone. You X out someone. Mm-hmm. You left. You left. To be promoted elsewhere. It's like somebody took a trip down memory lane though. And they emotional. This is your kimfo. Mm-hmm. It's your kimfo. Could be this fire sign. Somebody dealing with a fire sign. Some something that this can folk can start entertaining. And 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 that's a different spirit that's with them. A spirit of conviction is what I'm hearing. See, this can folk is the origin of splitting you from some from someone that you felt as though you belonged with. On Purpose is what I heard. Mm. That's the origin of it. Somebody told you to save your money and get ghosts, get litter, get away from your tempo. Mm-hmm. Somebody told you to do that. For you to recognize, analyze, and realize. What, what's been taking place with your family? See, this I love you so much. Yeah, family over everything. You're going to turn that around. Family over everything. But it's it's been some sort of ending. Because it's been all type of daggers being thrown at you. For real. All type of daggers I'm seeing. And they're going to continue doing it. They're going to continue to do it. They're going to they gonna continue to do it. It's like big love, big hate. Big love, big hate. Some bullshit is what Jesus is saying. Some bullshit. Because it's like this, this energy, this flip-flop ass energy. One minute, a motherfucker want to be truthful and loyal to you. And then the next minute, you see they going against you. They're going against your grind. They're going against any anything that you celebrate and that really make you happy, right? It's like they it's like they want you to be alone or on the same shit brick road that they on. You know? And and it's like it's like what it is that you want. What is it that you want is what the Jesus is saying. Prosperity in what form? Because they want you to beware of some deceit and avoid some bullshit. Sidestep some shit is what they saying. Folk jealous of you. And it's, it's sad. They jealous of you and they don't want you to be happy. The G said be vigilant about retreating. They supporting you on that. They supporting you on that. Mm, mm, mm. What else, spirit? Hmm. Contemplating. Contemplation. You love sick. You love that person that your family promoted you to um push to the side. Right? You love them. Yeah. You love them, but somebody was all about Blindly accepting someone into their life because, you know, they, they had, you know, some coins is what I'm hearing. So, this family member, this feminine energy, um, it's like some, some type of scheming energy that they, that they have about them, I'm hearing. It's some sort of scheme and energy that they have about them. <clears throat> yeah. 
they a whoremonger. Lake Minnetonka diver. Um, damn. Yeah, they a whoremonger. A Lake Minnetonka diver. Fruit don't fall far from a tree is what I just heard. Shit. Fruit don't fall far from a tree. This could be a child's mother. Oh, goodness have mercy. Earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Mm. It's like somebody was quick on their feet concerning their heart. Somebody need to be quick on their feet concerning the heart of the matter. It's some, some good news that's coming towards you. It's some good news that's coming towards you. A smile that you can inherit um, for the for the present and for the future. It's a gift, is what I'm hearing. It's a gift. It's a gift. And this gift is gonna separate you from um from possessing any of this energy here. It's 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 something for you to think about, is what I heard. Something for you to think about. Um, and be courageous about how you about to deal moving forward, bruh. How you about to deal moving forward. Because if you're dealing with a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, there's some infidelity going on. There's going to be a confession about that. Your kinfolk may tell you. Or this person could, you know, be uh, this woman of fire. This dark-haired woman. or You know... Somebody's son is a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. That could be you. Take it where it resonates. Somebody just moved into a new home. There's about to be a separation. And the G said it's going to be beneficial. It's going to be beneficial. You're about to have some new beginnings. You're about to have some new beginnings. And, 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 and how this is going to begin is with you loving on yourself. By you having the courage to separate yourself from the normal bullshit. The, the, the normal bullshit is what I heard. It's like ain't shit changed. Nothing. The G said it's a good time to start that shit too. Loving on yourself. And getting little. Separating yourself from these people. They about, It's about to be something that come to you. Quick. Quick. It might be by way of one of your children. Or your child's mother. Could be your mom. Mm-hmm. About some about them dishonoring you. About the lies that they've told to you. The lies that they've spread. To keep you away. To keep you apart from someone that you felt as though you belonged with. And, and masculine. King. Bruh. I'm hearing you still feeling some loss behind that. You love sick. Mm-hmm, look, manipulation, manipulation. You know, this, this, this woman that they wanted you away from, look, this woman's soul is intact, bro. Damn, they foul. And she was your security. She was your security. They, they breached the security. They had you suspicious of this woman with the lies that they were telling. It was an inside job. It was an inside job. I'm seeing something about this woman telling you something, though. She told you something that you could trust. This woman is very smart, and this woman is, is, is very generous still concerning you. But with the help of these family members, this woman has become a memory of the past. Whoever you're with now, question it, bro. This might be some hard shit that you hear. Question it. You can believe what that past woman was saying is what I'm hearing. Whoever this youngin' is, could be your son or your daughter. Take it where it resonates. You may be dealing with somebody younger than you. But this one kid of yours is your 
that's that's your ex. They probably always with you, or you always on the phone with them, or something. It's something about this attachment that they have with this past person. This past person, or this new person, take it where it resonates. Yeah, take it where it resonates. Somebody wants a new beginning. Mm. Confirmation. Perplexed. Embarrassed. This is a confirming message for you. It's something that had you thinking a little bit too much. Had your mind boggled and racing. Mm-hmm. Mother figure. Mother figure. Your mother. Your past uh, person's mother. Or your current person's mother. Take it how it resonates. Something about what you should be intuitively aware about this woman. Was that good advice that they gave you? Was this woman really honest and devoted to your cause, right? There's a loving intelligence that this woman possesses and it's, and it's very deceptive. Very, very, very deceptive. This, this mother figure had been studying you. This mother figure had been studying you. Mm-hmm. Studying you and how you deal with your mates. Want an end on that man. So no, this ain't your mama. This ain't your mama. This is either your current person's mother or your past person's mother. Who so-called gave you some wise counsel. The G said you don't need to deal with none of them. It's about to be some pro it's about to be a promotion. A promotion for you to ascend. Is what I'm hearing. You about to make a transition, bro. You are. You about to tap into some knowledge in this reading. And you're going to further tap into it, god dang it. Your kid about to tell you something, too. One of your children about to tell you something. Mm-hmm. One of your children about to tell you something. Mm. And they're going to want some forgiveness. They're going to want some forgiveness. They, I'm hearing they were just doing as they were or as they were instructed. But what they paying attention to, damn, bro. What they paying attention to now and what they thinking about is your past person's good heart. Yeah, your past person's good heart. And how jealous and envious the women in your family were of your past person. You know, like I said, a lot of a lot of people be like, shit, if my family don't like you, was something wrong with you? No, it was something wrong with your family. They was they did not want you to collaborate with this past person. They did not want you to move with this past person. Maybe y'all had plans on 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 moving with one another. You hear me? The G's want you to pay attention now, presently now, to this past person's good heart. You got free will, but they want you to tap in. They do. They want you to tap in. They want you to balance out some 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 energy and some thoughts and the way that you think about this past person. You know? The way that you think about this past person. Mm. Something about this past person's glow up. Something about this past person's glow up. They could be an earth sign. They could be a water sign. They could be an air sign. Take it how it resonates, fellas. But this person is no longer in your life. And this was a very solid bond. This was somebody that you felt like you was going to grow old with. We belong together. I can't sleep at night when you're all on my mind. Bobby, what would she say? Bobby Womax on the radio. Mm -hmm, go listen to it. Wait a minute, this is too deep. And you changed the station. You changed the station. Y'all was on the same wavelength, bro. What you gonna do? 
what you going to do? Chances make champions. Chances make champions. But who is this in this Chris, this Chris Bender? Who would I choose? Energy. Is that, are you in this energy? The G said still. No, you're not. No, you're not. You still hold a lot of compassion and love for this past person. The G said, take this. Yeah. Because look what's at the bottom. Broken promises. You broke some promises. This past person broke some promises. Mm. It's connection though. Right? You still feel it. You still feel it. This person still supports you spiritually. They desire you as well. Isn't that something, bro? They desire you as well. Mm-hmm. So that's you and this player energy. Your camp folk trying to keep you in this player energy. This Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius most definitely is in some player energy. You hear me? They got two notches on their belt. The G said they got two strikes too. They can't make a third one. They they can't they can't make a third one. Whoever this feminine energy is, they have very dark, dark energy. Very dark energy, right? Sad bitch, sad bitch energy. Mm, a lot of confusion. Feeling a lot of loss and error with these endings, right? This past ending, and it's going gonna, it's gonna to feel like, you know, time is repeating itself because you're going to feel a lot of loss and error because it's an ending coming. It is, and it's like you're going to put some distance between you and the whole motherfucking group of them, family included, you know, loving them from a distance, bro. I see a proposal of love. I do. I see a proposal of love. Somebody you got to travel to see by plane, maybe. You going to drive. Mm. Hmm. Maybe one of your kids live at a distance. Because I see legacy. It's something about you that's magical that you better recognize, analyze, and realize too. You hear me? Recognize, analyze, and realize something about you is magical. Observe you in this past person and about the success that you had within this love union. I see marriage. I see you wanting a second chance too. I see a long-term proposition. 